hi my amazing family welcome back to my channel in this video we are going to talk about food that we can eat to promote healthy and strong hair growth if you want to know more keep watching most of us want to grow our hair long and healthy to do that we already know that we need to keep our scalp and hair clean we also need to keep our hair moisturized we need to have a great hair regimen and routine i'm showing you right now the routine that i have during the three months cornwalls challenge so we all know that we need a good hair regimen and routine but sometimes we forget that we also need to balance our food i'm not gonna ask you to change your life completely but at least try to eat as healthy as possible today i'm gonna tell you a few benefits of salmon chickpeas and potatoes for your body and hair and i'm also gonna show you how i add them to my diet Salmon is rich in nutrients for your body and hair. It can also reduce the risk of developing certain diseases. Salmon is great in keeping our heart healthy. It's rich in omega-3 fatty acids. It's a great source of protein. 100 grams of salmon contains about 20 grams of protein. It has amino acids, vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin B12, B3, zinc, iron, and it's also rich in antioxidants. Studies have shown that taking supplements that contain omega-3, omega-6 fatty acids and antioxidants reduced hair loss and increased hair density. So you see salmon has that. You will find that naturally when you eat salmon. So salmon is really a great ingredient to add to your diet. Now let's talk about chickpea. Chickpea is also a great ingredient to add to your diet. It has fiber, so it will boost your digestive health. It's great for the heart. It can also help prevent cancer. Chickpea is also a great source of protein. The best part is that chickpea is also great for our hair. It's rich in protein. It also contains manganese, which can make your hair stronger. It has vitamin A, zinc, and a lot more benefits for our body and hair in general. Now, let me tell you a few benefits about potato. Potato is very economic and it's rich in benefits for our body and hair. It contains vitamin B, vitamin C, zinc, iron. These nutrients can nourish the hair follicles and promote faster hair growth. And I also have to say that potato is great to eat. You have a lot of great benefits from eating it. But some people apply the potato juice directly on the hair. I never tried that before, but people who tried it said that the hair feels really soft after applying potato juice. It restores the shine in the hair and it boosts hair growth i never tried it as i said but maybe after i take down the cornrows i can try it and see if that will be true for me okay you know everybody's different so maybe i can try that and see so right now i'm at the fish market i am about to get myself some salmon and some fish and when I get home, I will just clean them and store them in the freezer. Can I please have a bag? Thank you. I 
am back home as you can see i got some fish i got salmon today i am going to cook the salmon but i'm gonna clean everything i'm not gonna show you all that but usually what i do i just clean the fish like i clean the fish and wash it because i don't want my freezer to smell like fish now i'm about to clean and wash the salmon so i can prepare it the salmon is all clean right now i am going to marinate the salmon i am not gonna show you the whole process because i don't have a cooking channel i'm just showing you a quick process as you can see i already have my seasonings it's really really a strong and tasty one it's homemade <laughs> yeah so now i'm gonna cover it and then i am gonna keep it for a few hours so my salmon can taste good a few hours later i am going to start preparing the food i already have my cooked chickpeas and i have my potatoes and carrots and in a pot i put some tomato paste i am going to prepare my salmon but first i am going to put the potatoes because you know these takes very long time to cook and then i will put the carrots If you're watching and you like the video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and if you're not a subscriber please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications bell so you don't miss another video from me now I just added a little bit of seasonings I didn't put a lot because you know I am going to put the salmon that has a lot of seasonings so I put a little bit of seasonings a little bit of salt and then I add my water so I can cook the potatoes. Now the potatoes are almost ready. I added the chickpeas. I'm gonna keep the chickpeas for about five minutes so they can have some good taste. And then I will add the salmon. You see, so right now I'm about to add the salmon on top because I don't wanna overcook the salmon and then I don't wanna break it, you know? So I'm just adding it on top of the vegetables and then I can say that it's ready. You know, a salmon doesn't take really long to cook. It's very, very quick. Five, 10 minutes, it's ready. So now the salmon is ready. I am just going to put it in my pan and then I can say that I'm all done. You could also bake your salmon. You can bake your potatoes, you know. I was just showing you one of the ways I make my salmon and potatoes. But as I said, there is so many other ways that you can prepare your salmon. But this one, I love to make it this way because I can use the sauce to eat my rice. I can use the sauce to eat other vegetables. That specific day, I cooked some plain white rice and I ate it with the sauce and the salmon. It was amazing. I'm telling you, when you take that sauce and you put it on your rice, you will eat a whole plate if you don't control yourself. <laughs> that's it for the video as i always say you know that i love you so so much because there's a lot of people out there that you can sit down and watch but you decided to give me a few minutes of your precious time it really means the world to me thank you so so much for watching i cannot wait to see you in my next one bye